joined around four months ago and got three job offers. तब मेरा दिमाग में नहीं था कि job चाहिए ऐसा कुछ. I just had an keen interest in coding. After graduating from college, it was three or three college, and I didn't participate in any of the placements in the college. Uh, even when I was working like for nine thousand rupees per month, even my parents used to ask, why are you working so hard? And there is no outcome. I used to say like, doesn't matter. In I am just thinking of long term. Eventually, it is building my profile. Just get started. Even if it pays low, it doesn't matter. Eventually, you are going to grow. You have to be consistent. You have to love what you do. Hi everyone, and welcome to another pod. Uh, today we have Pradeep. Pradeep is from Super Thirty Paid. He joined uh, around four months ago, and got three job offers. We'll talk about all three of them. Eventually, he joined Finder for twenty LPA, fifteen LPA cash, and five LPA equity. We'll understand his journey. Shuru se, how did he get three of those offers? Two of those offers came through me. One of them he explored on by himself, and eventually joined the you know best offer that he could get. So, Pradeep, let's start from the top. Yes. Uh, thank you, sir, for inviting me to the podcast. And let's start from the beginning. So. When I started coding, when I was in class eleventh, so us time कभी ये नहीं था कि job के लिए करना है coding. It was my keen interest. So during my eleventh and twelfth, I spent all my time in coding. Uh, तब मेरे मेरे दोस्त सभी G की preparation, coaching वगैरह जाते थे. But I used to spend my time in coding. तब मेरा ध्यान नहीं था कि uh, job के लिए चाहिए. But बस interest के लिए दिन भर coding करता था उस time. I used to build like basic uh, landing page, login screens, animations. बहुत तब बहुत मजा आता था. Then uh, eventually uh, जब ट्वेल्थ क्लास ट्वेल्थ खत्म हो गया आई हैड टू डिसाइड तब मैंने सी ई टी वगैरह दिया नहीं जी का एग्जाम नहीं दिया सो आई हैड ऑप्शन टू गो टू बी सी ए तो मैंने बी सी ए ज्वाइन कर लिया एंड तब मेरा दिमाग में नहीं था कि जॉब चाहिए ऐसा कुछ आई जस्ट हैड एन किन इंटरेस्ट इन कोडिंग तब मेरे दिमाग में था कि विप्रो में या फिर टी सी एस सर्विस बेस्ड में हो जाए तो बड़ी बात है then during my college days i just uh, started preparing for all this and ek bar maine ek video dekhi thi ek there a person used to say like in amazon there's 40 lpa in google there's 50 lpa tab mujhe click hua ki bhai itna de rahe bande so uh, why can't i try to maine road map follow karna start kar diya to har ek road map mein ek cheez common thi dsa so i started preparing dsa uh, in my first year uh, i started dsa maine around lead code pe around 750 फिफ्टी प्रॉब्लम सॉल्व कर दिए एंड इन माई फर्स्ट ईयर आई लाइक लर्न अबाउट मोन स्टैक बिल्ड बेसिक प्रोजेक्ट इन माई फर्स्ट ईयर इट सेल्फ देन इन सेकेंड ईयर अगेन सेम आई डी डी एस ए आई प्रैक्टिस डी एस एंड एंड वेन एंड ड्यूरिंग माई कॉलेज डेज आई टुक पार्ट इन मल्टीपल कोडिंग इवेंट्स आई पार्टिसिपेट इन अराउंड टेन कॉन्टेस्ट एंड आई वॉन्ट लाइक टेन ऑफ टेम लाइक या आफ्टर ग्रेजुएटिंग फ्रॉम कॉलेज I didn't participate in any of the placements. Like college, me aate nahi the placements, and it was three or three college, and I didn't participate in any of the placements in the college. Then uh, soon after college, like um, most of my friends, like ninety-five uh, percent of the friends, they were going for MCA. So, yesa hota hai generally ki BCA ke baad most of them go for MCA because BCA plus MCA is equivalent to B.Tech degree. एंड uh, मेरे मन में नहीं था कि पढ़ाई नहीं होती अभी वह uh, हो गया अभी सी ए में अभी और नहीं करना पढ़ाई है सो so, uh, तो मैंने घर पे बोल दिया कि अभी एम सी ए का एंट्रेंस एग्जाम है तो मैं प्रिपरेशन कर रहा हूँ मैं घर पे बोल रहा था कि मेरा प्रिपरेशन कर रहा हूँ बट एक्चुअल में एग्ज़ाम हो चुकी थी हाँ राइट सो देन मैंने बोल दिया घर पे एग्ज़ाम uh, वगैरह हो चुका है अभी दैस नो चांस आई कैन गो इन टू एम सी ए या देन लाइक इवन माई पेरेंट्स ओल्ड ओके दैट्स ओके लेट्स यू कैन स्टार्ट प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर योर नेक्स्ट इंटरव्यूज और जस्ट गेट अ जॉब देन आई स्टार्टेड हंटिंग जॉब्स इन अक्टोबर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री या अक्टोबर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री लाइक आई स्पेंड आई अप्लाइड फॉर मोर देन टू हंड्रेड कंपनीज एंड आई गॉट इंटरव्यू फॉर टेन कंपनीज बट सब में रिजेक्ट हो गया उसके बाद देन वन ऑफ माई फ्रेंड वॉज वर्किंग फॉर बोट लाइक ही वॉज बिल्डिंग अ कस्टमर सपोर्ट फॉर बोट this thing earphones so he uh, basically invited me like to work together and let's build this product so i started uh, working with him uh, it it's it, it was kind of freelance uh, i would say and then during this journey i also got an internship from an bangalore based startup at tech startup thi wo and they were paying like around 9k inr per month and and my first salary from my friend what, what i received was around 7k so as a mahine ka around 16 17k hota tha But gradually, as I worked with my friend, थोड़ा थोड़ा बढ़ता गया बढ़ता गया it was like थर्टी के लास्ट टाइम लाइक द लास्ट सैलरी विच आई रिसीव्ड वॉज थर्टी के पर मंथ सो ड्यूरिंग दैट टाइम लाइक आई वॉज वर्किंग 
uh, internship as well as I was working with my friend uh, in my freelance projects. So it was like a grind season for me. Like I didn't focus more on pay. I focused more on this uh, skills, upskilling myself. And during that time, I also took your cohort. So I used to attend your weekly classes on cohort. And during my weekdays, I used to work like around 15 to 16 hours a day. Like it was complete grind at that time. Like during, uh, I used to start my day with my internship. And just say internship se log out karta tha, I used to work uh, with my friend like to build products for the companies. Yeah, so yeah that's all like uh, after that uh, i left the company like uh, it was around september 2024 i left my company and then i started looking for other jobs then aapka super 30 aaya tha october mein i think yeah october mein aapka super 30 aaya tha then i joined super 30 and then uh, i grinded again uh, same grind again in super 30 like i used to come uh, to the office at morning 4 am and bachche 4 baje ja rahe the ghar sone so i used to see like people around me are so hard working why can't i put more effort like itna saal kiya hai aur aur kuch time kar lete effort dalte ho jayega matlab tha confidence tha ki ho jayega isme so yeah uh, after that uh, you referred me to a company i gave the interview and yeah yeah uh, it all happened got it very yes. cool that's interesting so you were working at a 30k that was the last salary that you took yes 30k got it that's interesting okay uh, cool super that you using expensive program uh, so what made you pay for it I mean, did you not have contentions before joining yes uh so it was expensive i would say but uh but roi i looked at the roi like uh i i had i had confidence in myself ki mujhe bas referral ke liye chahiye tha even in the first talk which I, we we had uh, i just i told i just told you like i just want a referral and the community support uh upskilling wagera i used to know like maine kar rakha tha 0 to 100 i was like uh, i was able to build applications in monster i used to deploy them on kubernetes devops wagera aata tha mujhe us time tak i just wanted a referral so i just mujhe confidence tha ki ho jayega bas i'll just go and grind aur referral ki baat thi bas ek and that's what super 30 helped me a lot so how uh, long after you joined you probably joined i don't remember when did you start september i think yes. mid of september so how long after that did you get the referral yeah i got the referral in two months and i the interview process like went for another one month so i would say after three months i was onboarded into the company yeah got it and was there a trial period yes so after soon after my interview uh there was a trial period for two weeks but the founder liked my work so uh, they cancelled the next week and just onboarded me in the first week itself. Got it. Yeah. So that was your first interview that you got into Finder. That's right. that's where you eventually joined. Right. You also interviewed at Conch and a Dubai based company that you found yourself. Yes. So let's talk about Conch. I'll give brief to Conch. Conch was a company that I put on the group in a random tweet. And then there's a different student called Chirag who got into Conch first. It wasn't a good fit, so he left. And then he asked Pradeep to interview there. And then Pradeep got there as well. So how was the conch yeah. interview process? Yes. Uh, so Chirag basically referred me into that company. Like the founder was also looking for a developer. Then uh, there was a basic uh, introduction round. Uh, he he liked my GitHub profile. Uh, he saw that consistency, the graph streaks and stuff. So he basically didn't ask much about technical. He just asked about my compensation. And yeah, uh, he basically asked me to join from the next day itself. And that's all. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, no interview, no technical interview. Basically, uh, he didn't ask about technicals. Uh, he just liked about my uh, profile and my all my tweets and my LinkedIn profile. He uh, he just went through all my profile uh, work, and there was no technical interview. Basically, very interesting. And how was the interview at Finder? Yeah, uh, there were two rounds. Basically, the first round was behavioral round. Uh, uh, it was pretty chill the interview. And in the technical round, they uh, like they asked me about React JS and Next JS. They went to the basics. They wanted to check whether my basics are clear or not. So they asked me basic questions and then they asked me to implement a custom component. Uh, I just coded it. Like uh, the interview went for like one hour. And as as I coded, like they asked me the questions related to uh, related to what I was coding. So proper interview that happened over there. Yeah. And then you were applying to a company in Dubai yourself. Um, yeah. You also referred me to them to I, after you decided not yes. to join. I referred a few people there. They weren't able to get in. Apparently, the interview was pretty brutal. So can you talk through the interview yes. there? So the Dubai-based company, uh, one of my friend, like uh, the friend which I mentioned uh, when I started, that person uh, was currently working here as a manager. So I basically hired, like he referred me there. Uh, the Like there were two rounds. 
the first round was behavioral round and the second round was technical they asked me to code the front end uh, they asked me to like uh, state management global state management and 10 stack query they asked me to integrate an api and in the back end uh, even the assessment uh, like they asked questions related to back end uh, for example they asked me to write an aggregation pipeline to write analytics yeah so they uh, asked about front end and back end and like after 12 hours the founder reached out to me like you are selected uh, please uh, how like uh, when are you starting so i had uh, two offers then like finder and this uh, but i chose uh, finder ai because since ai is at boom like uh, the future is growing so i chose finder it was pure web2 company the dubai based company uh, so i chose uh, the finder ai and was the offer there yeah it was 1500 usd I mean, that's around uh, that's not 12 lpa yeah, yeah 12 lpa yeah. yeah. yeah got it makes sense cool so to get that understand everything now uh, seems like for you uh, you know you have the skills uh, yes. which aren't too hard to get what's hard is you know getting an interview or whatever uh, getting into the ecosystem uh, so we'd love to know okay if someone in, who you know can't afford a cohort also or super 30 or anything uh, how would they gain the same skills as you is do you think doing a lower paid internship like you did with your friend helps hmm. yeah so i think just get started even if it pays low it doesn't matter eventually you are going to grow it's just you you have to be consistent you have to love what you do you doesn't pay like uh, even when i was working like for nine uh, nine thousand rupees per month even my parents used to ask why are you working so hard and there is no outcome i used to say like doesn't matter in i'm just thinking of long term eventually it is building my profile so i didn't matter about the pay just i just grinded like i know everything is going to be uh, better in the future so i didn't care about the pay like even if a person who is starting out even if the pay is less don't bother about the pay right now just grind be consistent love your work yeah, that's all i would say i think that's one thing that's still missing with a lot of people or jispe wo nahi hoti hai uske fir nahi lagti hai maine dekha hai so do you think that can that is an interest that can be developed ya fir wo bas core interest hi hota hai cs mein jiska hota hai yeah so uh, the interest in cs even if you don't have interest uh, initially the more you code right uh, the more you love your craft like uh, eventually you will gain interest like uh, agar aap din ke 15 ghante laga rahe ho you are spending like half of your time like half of your life in coding so aapko eventually you will love your work right uh, if you don't love your work then eventually you will drop off and yeah yeah you will stagnate yes, yes, oh, yes right tumhari so, early lag jayegi but then you will stay at 12 lpa forever right so <laughs> this is like an underrated thing okay, you know if you don't like computer science then eventually either you will plateau or in this market you might not even get a job uh, so you know the best thing you can do is uh, find core interest and if that's not there then you know there are other companies opportunities things to explore um, but this is the most important skill when you know you want to get a high paying job eventually or whatever you know, stay in cs because um, if you don't have core interest then eventually you will drop off because there will be highs and lows and when the lows come you will leave um, right. very cool uh, how's the work how do you how are you liking your work uh, the work is pretty chill uh, i like how they work the workflow is very systematic very well planned and yeah i basically work on f- full stack i'll develop the front end in xjs i developed the back end in fast api like recently i was working on the ios application isse pehle mujhe swift nahi aati thi so the founder told me like develop the application ios application and i didn't know swift to maine founder ko bola ki main seekh lunga and i'll build the application so i learned swift and i built the application and launched it on uh, basically a uh, test flight yeah right app store like it's in test flight basically right now yeah very cool uh theek hai so pretty dynamic work and you're getting to work on right. ai uh did you know fast api already did you learn it in this yeah uh regarding fast api uh it was i learned it when i was working with my friend like uh eight eight months ago then i revised the fast api again in super 30 like you had asked me to build a project a back end project on fast api there is uh, then i revised the fast api again then uh, now i'm working on fast api as well in my current company as a back end got it makes yeah. sense are you working on any ai Thing. Uh no, not really. Right, it's currently like full stack development, front end and back end as of now. Makes sense. Uh, what yeah, are I know. Uh, so my goal is to be a senior developer at a company, uh, gradually grow as a CTO in a a startup. I say yeah, that's my long term goal. Uh, yes. Yeah, I agree. I think that's the best thing you can aim for. The one of the good thing, or you know, the reason at least I also want to want to be a CTO is because uh, you can provide a lot of value, gain a lot of value, extract a lot of value, and yet be behind the scenes. You don't have to worry about the business. So if you actually really like tech. 
you would eventually gravitate towards either an IC or you know a CTO at a company, uh, which is usually the 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 place where you want to be eventually. Um, very cool. Uh, any parting thoughts? Anything for someone who's you know currently struggling at a nine k offer or thirty k offer? Yeah, uh, my suggestion would be to grind. Don't look at your pay. Just be consistent. Love your craft, and yeah, eventually it will pay off. That's what I would say. Cool. With that, we'll call it. Thank you, Pradeep, for joining. Yeah, thank you, sir. Today.